tonight. It's a very important event. It's called Ottawa's Unbirthday Party, and it's uh, happening July 27th. With all the details right now, we say hello to the planner of the Ottawa Unbirthday Party first, Renee Seward. Nice to have you here. Thank you. We also have Nicole Callender, the founder of Friends for Kindness. Oh, hello, Nicole. Good Hi, thanks you. for having us. Well, let's start with Friends for Kindness. Uh, tell us a, a bit about that organization. So last year, my daughter, who has special needs, was going to be 18 and was in grade 12. And um, she was sad that she wasn't having the same milestones that typical grade 12 students were getting, like graduation, prom, etc. So I asked friends and family to mail her birthday cards between July, so January and July, mm -hmm. so that um, when the milestones were happening, she would feel the love coming in through this mail. Hmm. And it went viral, and we received over 6,000 cards to date. Whoa. Right. Whoa. That's yeah. a lot. What did, what did you do with all those, all those cards? <laughs> right now they're in boxes. Yeah. Um, I, I'm going to make a big collage for her uh, because they're still coming in, the, these cards. Really? Yeah. Well, that's a, that's a success story for sure. Yes, but yeah. with the cards, I also got hundreds of messages from, because people were following her, opening these cards on Facebook and social media. But with the cards came hundreds of messages from parents saying, my kid, or my child, doesn't get invited to birthdays. My child never has people come to their birthdays, so we understand the loneliness she was feeling. Mm -hmm. And I felt, okay, my daughter's now getting this attention, and I'm seeing her self-worth and confidence grow, and there's so many kids that feel, that will have this confidence and self-worth because they're lonely and don't get invited to, or mm -hmm. celebrated as well. Okay, so, so you are based out of Hamilton, correct? Correct. Okay, so this happens in different cities, the unbirthday party. Yeah, well, last year um, we just had it in Brantford, um, Ontario, because I, for her 18th birthday, I invited all these kids who I got these messages from to come to celebrate with Caitlin, all these kids that never get invited to birthdays. And we had over 200 kids from all over Ontario and the United States show up at this party. Um, some actually drove from Ottawa, so six hours to just to go to a birthday party. Mm. So then this year we decided that we would form Friends for Kindness and we would have the unbirthday parties all over Ontario so we could reach more kids. That's good. Larkin Park is where it's going to be taking place in Nepean. Uh, Renee, I've got to ask you then, so what happens at an unbirthday party? Well, basically we have a lot of volunteers and people that have donated their businesses and all that are going to be coming. Um, and uh, the kids can come. It's open to anybody. Um, and they, are ba they basically, they're going to come and celebrate like it's their birthday mm -hmm. we've got balloons and we've got like tons of games we have full-size carnival games coming really good yes and we've got the barbecue coming mm -hmm. we have many people that have donated to the barbecue itself um, it's going to be a, a great day it so just, it sounds like a lot of fun of course right. and, and, and it wouldn't be uh, taking place without friends for kindness so it's very important Nicole for you to see ability and not disability that's uh, one of your, your mandates, basically. The, the basic part of Friends for Kindness and these on birthday parties is a lot of these kids, I, I don't believe kids, I get a lot of messages that why are kids cruel? Why aren't these kids invited to birthdays? I believe that kids don't mean to be cruel. I just think they avoid kids with disabilities because they don't know how to act. They don't know if the kids would like the same things or how they communicate and stuff. So these parties are really showcasing that kids with disabilities have amazing abilities and that they like the same things that typical children do and they can commute they have ways to communicate their needs and mm -hmm. um, so we really want to showcase to to children that there's no need to avoid them just ask us and we'll show you they, they're just as much fun as okay. you are right so you're still looking for help in regards to when it comes to, to birthday cards and stamps and so so how would that work how can someone get on board and be a part of this yeah so because of the birthday parties are in the summer and they're not really typically the kids birthday um, we have card uh, people writing birthday cards across the country so on the child's actual birthday month if you if the uh, you know the parents want to sign them up the card people sorry <laughs> the people writing the cards will mail the child a birthday card on their actual birthday and they can check um, contact me through our Facebook page friends for kindness that's the easiest probably way to contact that's us great. Renee on the 27th what time does all the fun get underway it starts at noon yeah. and it goes till 4 p.m. okay are, what are you looking for at this point I mean are you are you still looking for people to jump on board like well, we, we can we definitely can um, have lots of volunteers show up they can show up at 11 o'clock mm -hmm. and uh, yeah we can use volunteers but we'll for find yeah to. everything else is pretty much taken care of that's fun so it's yeah. open to everybody it's open to everybody we're yeah. inclusive Every, yeah. it's inclusive to everybody the more people there the more we're celebrating these that's kids. An amazing thing just over 20 seconds left here quickly uh, Nicole one day you're hoping to expand Christmas perhaps other holidays Days. Yeah, play dates throughout the winter, hopefully, and we're trying to reach more cities. We want to have these parties in as many cities as possible because the more cities, the more we're reaching the children. Okay, that's amazing. Thank Thanks. you very much, Renee, Nicole, friendsforkindness.ca. We appreciate your time. Thank, thank you, you very much. much. And thank you, as always, for being here. My name is Dylan Black. We'll see you soon.